For those of you that are upgraders, if you're coming from an Apple Silicon M1, it's probably time to upgrade. If you're coming from an Intel, this is no brainer. Any Apple Silicon can be faster, but I would definitely skip the M1 generation at this point. Probably go with the M2, if not the M3, or if you can really stretch it, I would probably go with M4 generation. The interesting enough is that the price spread for all these are not going to be too far apart. That M4 is just a really good SOC and a really great generation to jump into. So that's my personal thought on that one. Remember to upgrade priority. I still recommend that you choose the amount of RAM you need first, then choose the ship family based on the RAM that you have. A lot of times the amount of memory will dictate that. SSD storage size and then choose the ship variant. We can, we don't seeing really the ship variant because I didn't include to the M4 Pro. Mac Mini, I might do that a little bit later on, but as of now, that's what we can see. However, there are some variations that you're going to see in the M4 Pro base versus the M4 Pro top specs SOC that I'm going to show in the 14, 16 inch MacBook Pro review video. As